Hey guys, Marty here. Welcome back to Snappy Videos. This is episode number 12 in our 10 years of Digimon World series. Today, we're going to be taking on several days in year 3. Last episode, we recruited Tyrannomon. This episode, this episode smells fishy. That's right guys, we're going fishing because I want Seedramon. But first, we need to get ourselves a much better fishing rod. We sold some items at the shop and got a heap of Digimon cards so we could trade them to the fat frogman in the swamp for a fishing rod. It sounds weird, really really weird but that's what we have to do so we're gonna do it we set out towards the swamp and made it all the way until outside of trash mountain before getting into a fight nuts was beating the crap out of this purple nose drilling mole we didn't take much damage and he went down pretty quickly we found a mushy then entered the swamp we found fatso and i learned that he would want 300 mirror points to get the amazing rod from him so i traded him a heap of cards but honestly it wasn't enough we still needed way more cards. I ended up having a total of 30 merit points. We're going to need a boatload more Digimon cards if we want to get this fishing rod. On the way out, I made Nuts take on a load of Digimon so we could get more money to spend on trading cards. We took down a Dragonfly who gave us 600 bits. That's 6 more cards we can get. The second Dragonfly also gave us 600 bits and an MP floppy. We autopiloted back to the city and got heaps more cards from the machine. I then went and sold some items and got even more cards. Surely this is close to what we need for 300 merit points, right? I spent what felt like 17 more days at the machine getting cards. Then we went and saw Agumon and got some more items to sell. I'm honestly basically this crazy with trading cards in real life. Now I get to get them on a game, I'm gonna go crazy. We went back to the shop, sold some more items and filled up on all the Digimon cards we could afford. I checked out our set, we had a couple of rare cards but mostly a heap of common cards. I wasn't sure if this would be enough. So I took on some more battles around the city for some spare change. We hit this green fellow once and he only had one HP left. Nuts, not good enough. Get stronger mate. After a couple more battles we rested at the doctor's office, got some more cards and ventured off to see Lord Fatso. We had a couple of battles on the way for some cash, had a nup under a tree and after several more battles made it to Lord Fatso's love shack. I traded loads of cards. Some of them were worth about 30 merit points each, which was looking good, but I only had a couple of the rare ones. I did have a few worth 10 points. The rest weren't really worth that much, but I traded them anyway, as I wanted all the points we could get. And well, did we have enough? Nope, Marty, you need to spend more money on trading cards. More card opening videos. Oh, and more cards in the game, obviously. We ended up with 182 merit points. So we only need 118 more points and we can get this rod. We autopiloted back to the city again and collected some meat. We had a trading card addiction. We don't need to eat, so we can sell these. We did a whale poopy. and went to the shop. I sold all of the sirloin and hit the card machine. We got loads of cards, but did we get any rare ones? Yeah, kinda. We got the Fat Man and Andromon. We also have a heap of common cards, so hopefully we can get enough to get our rod. Do you reckon there will be? I'm gonna say probably not, so let's get some more stuff to sell. I hit up Agumon and got some stuff I didn't really need. I'd sell my fridge for Digimon cards, let's be honest. I sold some HP chips and some other stuff and hit the card machine, spamming the X button and getting loads more cards. Did we get any rares this time? Yeah, we did. We got a couple more. We did a little bit more training because why not? Then we set out to see Lord Fatso. I sold a card worth 100 points. What? That put us on 282 points. We were getting so close to this amazing rod. Then the next card, well that was worth 100 as well. Fishing rod, here we come. I sold the rest of the cards and ended up with 549 merit points. I got us the amazing rod and a few soup recoveries as well. We left Lord Fatso's and got into a couple of battles. We got back to File City and stocked up on items for our adventure and then wandered down to the lake. Seedramon was there and swimming around, but I pulled on the line way too early and the first couple of times it got away. When Seedramon was finally hooked, we had a massive fight. He swam hard and was looking like he might break off a couple of times. I fought well and rested a few times when the line was red. He eventually came in close to the shore and I reeled him in. We made friends and then Seedramon took us to Beetle Island. Here, we recruited two more Digimon who will help us with our training. After recruiting these guys, we spoke to Gigimon who told us that the entrance to Mount Infinity was now open. This means we could actually technically finish the main story of the game. This is it. We're going to have this game finished way before 10 years. But are we ready? Let's see what we can do on the next episode with this newfound knowledge.